Let's step into the shoes of the Monmouth Hawks. You're trailing by two at halftime, but the other team's star guard, he has 13 points. Coach King Rice makes some second half adjustments, but now the team's other star guard scores 17 points and finishes with 24. Joe Girard and Judah Mintz combined for 40 points tonight, helping Syracuse pick up an 86-71 victory over the Monmouth Hawks. And after the game, Coach Beheim talked about how his two guards helped Syracuse pick up a win. Judah and Joe did all they could to try to keep us ahead and try to win the game. I, I thought they really played well and uh, you know, were the difference in the, in the game tonight. He's a really good player in his, his own right. Um, I mean, we knew that coming in, and obviously he's, he's shown it here at the beginning of the season. So he's done a good job for us. He's, he's, uh, he's turned into a pretty good leader as a point guard as well. Um, and he competes. I think that's the biggest thing. So you know you want to play alongside those kind of people. And uh, when guys are you know, focused on winning and competing like he is, it usually turns out to be pretty good. Uh, I mean, yeah, I, mean, I have confidence as a player, and, and Joe does too. Uh, and I think we, we feed off each other pretty well, uh, both in the zone and in the offensive end. So really just knowing uh, where each other's spots are, uh, getting Joe the ball where he's good at. So uh, I think we could be <laughs> as good as any backcourt in the country if you ask me when, when we're both clicking. Five Orange players scored in double figures, including Malik Brown, who had a career high of 11 off the bench tonight. Syracuse is back in action on Saturday afternoon against the Cornell Big Red for a 3 p.m. tip-off. Reporting inside the JMA Wireless Dome, Nick Zelaya, Citrus TV.